let's now talk about the editor which you will use of course you can use any editor you want for WordPress development but I can just suggest some I've been using Sublime for some time for for several years actually and it's a great great tool which you can download get to and get it to work instantly and you can also use some some patches and something like that so you can also enhance your WordPress development with ready to go snippets and stuff like that you can also use Atom so Atom is the text editor from github and it's also a good choice to work so as you can see those packages they are similar to sublime and if you type wordpress and go you can you can see some of the stuff such as the autocomplete for wordpress functions wordpress api and there are a bunch bunch of them which can enhance your workflow by while developing WordPress WordPress plugins or teams or something like that there is also Visual Studio Code which I have not tried for WordPress I did use Visual Studio when I worked on C Sharp and ASP, ASP.NET technologies but for WordPress I have not tried it although I did hear and read elsewhere that it's a very nice and good choice another popular tool but it's an expensive one is the PHP storm so that's actually the D D editor I think the IDE for PHP development and so since WordPress is on PHP it's all it can also come in handy while developing WordPress products uh, they are integrated with the, this tool is integrated with the debug tools and really a bunch of, of stuff which can really help you but if you're just eager to start and not dwell into setting up the ED for development you can you can just go straight up and download sublime or atom and just work from that and when you are satisfied with uh, how you are developing then you might go into some a little more advanced stuff such as debugging and deployment and similar stuff and then you can try the Visual Studio Code or PHP Storm or some other other tool. And that's it for this quick and simple tutorial.